good evening. Um, this is Chris and Alan. We're absent Bob for tonight, so usually Bob and Alan and Chris show. But uh, we will start off our evening prayers with the evening prayers <laughs> and then do the uh, scriptural rosary. So um, if you're joining us on YouTube, and you would like to join us live, you can do so at flame-keepers.com and click on the calendar link and it'll, you can pick a time that suits your, your schedule and join with us. We'd love to have you. You want me to start off or you want to start off? It doesn't matter. All right, I'll go ahead and start it. Okay. Oh God, come to our aid. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Soul, hope of all the world, and Lord, bestower of the great reward, receive the prayers thy servants raise, mixed with me, psalms and chant of praise. And though our conscience doth proclaim our deep transgressions and our shame, cleanse us, O God, we humbly plead from sins of thought and word of, the, of deed. Our sins remember thou no more. Forgive thou art of mighty power. So take upon thee, Lord, our care, that pure in heart we make our prayer. Therefore, accept, O Lord, this tide of fast which thou hast sanctified, that we may reach by mystic ways the sacraments of Easter days. The Lord guards his people. The Lord surrounds his people. Those who trust in the Lord are like the mountain of Zion. It cannot be shaken. It will stand firm forever. Jerusalem, the mountains stand guard over it, and the Lord stands guard over his people, both now and forever. The scepter, the scepter of the wicked shall not rest upon the inheritance of the just, lest the just themselves stretch out their hands and turn to wickedness. Welcome aboard, Bob. Got on a little bit ago and um, had a deal or not deal, but I was working with Agnes. wasn't I wasn't sure if I had to take Agnes back home. She doesn't have a car, so I had to pick her up this morning and maybe take her back. But got that solved. She's taking my car, and so <laughs> until her daughter brings it back. So it was kind of involving conversations and whatnot back and forth. Anyway, here I am. So where are we at? Well, welcome. We are on Be Good, O Lord, to the Good. Okay. Be, be good, O Lord, to the good and the upright of heart. As for those who turn away <clears throat> to crooked paths, the Lord shall treat them like the doers of evil. Peace be on Israel. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Childlike trust in God. Lord, I do not puff myself up or stare about or walk among the great or seek wonders beyond me. Truly calm and quiet, I have made my spirit quiet as a weaned child in his mother's arms, like an infant is my soul. That is your heart in the world. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Unless you come like a little child, you will not enter the kingdom of heaven. <clears throat> the canticle from Apocalypse 4, 5. Lord, you make us a kingdom and priests to serve our God. You are worthy, our Lord and our God, to receive glory and honor and power. For you made all things, and it is by your will 
that they exist and were created. You are worthy, Lord, to receive the book and open its seals, for you were killed, and with your blood you have ransomed people from every tribe and language and people and nation, and made them rulers and priests for God, and they will rule over the earth. The Lamb is worthy. Oh, sorry. No, sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> the Lamb is worthy, who was killed, to receive power and riches and wisdom, strength and honor, glory and blessing. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Lord, you made us a kingdom and priests to serve our God. Take the case, my brother. Oh, this is short reading from James 2, 14, 17, and 18. Take the case, my brothers, of someone who has never done a single good act but claims that he has faith. Will that faith save him? Faith is like that. Faith is like that. If, God, if good works do not go with it, it is quite dead. I will prove to you that I have faith by showing you my good deeds. Now you prove to me that you have faith without any good deeds to show. It's a different translation, okay? <clears throat> I said, Lord, have mercy on me. Lord, have it's mercy on me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. I said, Lord, have mercy. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. <clears throat> My heavenly Father, you will act the same way with me if you do not forgive your brother from your heart. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my salvation, for he has shown me much favor, me, his lowly handmaiden. Now all generations will call me blessed, because the mighty one has done great things for me. His name is holy. His mercy lasts for generations after generation for those who revere in him. He has put forth his strength. He has scattered the proud and conceited, torn princes from their thrones, but lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, the rich he has sent away, sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel. He has remembered his mercy as he promised to our father. Abraham and his children forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. My Amen. heavenly Father will my heavenly Father will deal the same way with you if you do not forgive your brother from your heart. Let us pray earnestly to Christ the Lord, who tells us to walk in faith, that we may not fall into temptation. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy. Lord Jesus, you promise to be with those who are gathered in your name. Keep us united with you as we pray to the Father and the Holy Spirit. Hear us, Lord. Cleanse your church from every stain of sin. Make her alive with hope and the power of the Spirit. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy. Help us to pray for your people, through your love for me. Through us, let the light of your salvation shine in the world. Hear us, Lord, have mercy. Let your peace spread to the ends of the earth. Let men see in every place the signs of your presence. <clears throat> Bring the dead to everlasting happiness. Let glory and immortal life be theirs. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy kingdom. Come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our debts, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. 
Do not withdraw your grace from us, Lord. By it alone, we can give ourselves wholly to your service and obtain your help in our every need. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the holy unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Chris, did you know that your system, your audio system, audible system, it's kind of reminds me when I was a kid, we used to listen to the AM radio and every time there was a, um, a uh, thunderstorm or rainstorm, the signal goes, yeah. Really? <laughs> I wonder, yeah, you're, I wonder if or, or, or a shortwave radio that is just barely on the fringe of the channel that you're trying to listen to. <laughs> I wonder where the mic is on this. <laughs> well, yeah. it's crazy because before Bob hopped on, I was able to hear you perfectly. Really? And after oh, Bob hopped it, on, it's, it's my on. fault. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> In other, words, in other words, I'm pulling too much power from the, from the internet. Okay. And, and now, now, now you're on. I'm like, okay, is he done? Is he done? Is he done? Oh, is it my turn? Oh, okay. <laughs> I get it. That might explain why uh, I'm using more electricity. Maybe my uh, solar system has gone in reverse instead of pulling energy out of the sun, it's sending energy to the sun. <laughs> 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 it has anything to do with the fact that I'm using the dryer every single day or this uh, air or air uh, concentrator thing is probably going at 1500 watts an hour. I don't know. <laughs> so tonight we will be doing the last Carl Kenton stream. Um, red or black? I'll let you two do it. Okay. I'm, right. um, I'm, I'm talked out for the day. <laughs> I bet. I'll, I'll take red. Okay. Okay. The Blessed Virgin Mary promised to St. Dominic and to all who follow that whatever you ask in the rosary will be granted. She left for all Christians 15 promises to those who recite the Holy Rosary imparted to St. Dominic and Blessed Alan de la Roche. I promise my special protection and the greatest graces to all those who shall recite the rosary. The rosary The rosary will cause virtue and good works to flourish. It will obtain for souls the abundant mercy of God. It will withdraw the hearts of men from the love of the world and its vanities and will lift them to the desire for eternal things. Oh, the souls would sanctify themselves by this holy means. The soul which recommends itself to me by the recitation of the rosary shall not fail. Whoever shall recite the rosary devoutly, applying himself to the consideration of its sacred mysteries, shall never be conquered by misfortune. God will not chastise him in his justice. He shall not perish by an unprovided death, and if he be just, he shall remain in the grace of God and become worthy of eternal life. Whoever shall have a good rosary shall not die in the obedience of the church. Those who are faithful to recite the rosary shall have during their life and at their death the light of God and the plenitude of his graces. And at the moment of death, they shall participate in the merits of the saints in paradise. I shall deliver from the saints who have been devoted. The faithful children of the rosary shall merit a high degree of glory in heaven. You shall obtain a great reputation. All those who propagate the holy rosary shall be aided by me in their necessities. I have obtained for you the other of the consideration of all the prayers they have been successful for during their life. All who recite the rosary are my sons and daughters and brothers and sisters of my only son, Jesus Christ. O Immaculate, I renew my consecration to you. 
May I never place limits on my love for you. Good evening. This evening we'll be praying through the sorrowful mysteries beginning with the Apostles' Creed, followed by our intentions. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, life everlasting. Amen. Amen. Divine Master, how frequently you spoke about seed in your teaching. Wonderful are the promises contained in the smallest seeds. The day and year planned for the birth of Jesus Christ was chosen and ended to say the gospel of the gospel. The day we are praying the gospel according to the Holy Spirit. Bless this seed and grant it full development and rich fruitfulness. And let us not forget that the most important seed we can ever sow into our hearts or the hearts of others is the word of God. We celebrate the beginning of our salvation and the Lord is blessed by the people. Let us truly fill our hearts with the word of God. May God's holy mother intercede for us. Mary received God's love with joy. May joy fill our hearts as we welcome our Savior. He looked with love on the world. In your mercy, Father, remember us and all your children. Mary, the new Eve, was obedient to your will. May, may we echo her loving obedience. May God's Holy Mother help all in distress, encourage the faith hearted, console the sorrowful. May she pray for your holy people, for the clergy, and for all women dedicated to your service. God, our Father, your word became flesh and born of the virgin Mary. May we become more like Jesus Christ, whom we acknowledge as our Redeemer, God and man. We ask this through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. We are praying tonight for an increase of faith, hope, and charity. We are praying that grace and peace would be ours in abundance through the knowledge of God and of Jesus Christ, our Lord. We are praying that as authentic MI members in these difficult times, we may place our trust in you for the March intention. We ask for the thunder roll of clarity over the spirit of the year and authority over death itself to manifest through our lives. We also lift up by prayer intention for this rosary, the prayer of St. Paul from the book of Ephesians, chapter 1, verses 17 through 19. We pray that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of glory, may give us a spirit of wisdom and of revelation in the knowledge of him. We pray that the eyes of our hearts may be enlightened so that we will know what is the hope of his call, what are the riches of the glory of his inheritance in the saints, and what is the boundless greatness of his power toward us who believe. We lift up the corporal and spiritual prosperity of our parishes and the Diocese of Salt Lake City, Boise, and Parramatta, Australia. We ask for wisdom for Bishop Solis, Christensen, and Long to shepherd God's flock, and we lift up the intentions of Father Vidal, Sternhagen, Silva, Lustig, Trujillo, Cummins, Martin, and Sandoval, and for the repose soul of Father Rene. We are praying for a hundred year vision for the plain church that we might spread the fire of God's love throughout Utah, Idaho, and the whole world. We lift up the daily Zoom room rosaries. We are asking for the increase inwardly and fruitfulness outwardly. We lift up our weekly priestly discipleship on Zoom 
Friday mornings at 5.30 a.m. with Father Vidal uh, to be started soon. We lift up our bi-weekly power pots. We're asking for continued spiritual growth and an increase of pods amongst all of the Flame Keeper locations. And we lift up our monthly friendship breakfast, which will be held, if I'm not mistaken, March the 26th at 8.30 a.m. at the American Legion in Clearfield. Uh, we lift up our monthly fire pit fellowship uh, Salt Lake City's Burning Ones Young Adult Fire Pit, Orem's Zoom Captain's Training, um, date to be determined, I believe. I'm not sure if they have anything. And then the Malad Idaho St. Paul Mission, February, February the 6th, or March, well, I guess it was March, so I don't know when the next one will be, in um, Malad. We're praying for relationships to deepen and love to increase. We lift up our monthly Misericordia Outreach and Circles program, and we lift up our bi-monthly iOS update and spiritual direction meeting. We're praying for peace, unity, and the spirit of strategic counsel to be present. We lift up our men's retreat, August 12th through the 14th, 2022, at 9 p.m. We ask for grace on all those. We ask for grace for the building of the bathrooms and showers at the Idaho Retreat site. Grace for the builders, art, and sale of the supernatural productivity and divine provisions of the fields. Annual Women's Retreat. Um, pray for a time and a date to be determined soon. Asking for grace on. The Lady Flame Keepers March breakfast, which will be with our breakfast on Saturday. Um, so all the women can gather and do their book reading. We lift up all developing Flame Keeper ministries, priests for Flame Keepers working, relationships, vision, organization, and understanding of roles. Annabelle's Angels Laborers for 24-7 Prayer and Worship, The Burning Ones Young Adult Internship, Catholic Mike, The Final Quest Book Reading Tool for Discipleship, The Almost Saved Evangelism, The Eye Power of Christian Fellowship, Joseph's Company, so we're praying for local businesses and workers, and also the Bi-Weekly Family Fast, Prayers for Parent and Child Relationships. We also want to and now let us unify our minds and spirits in a prayer for the United States of America, composed by His Excellency Archbishop Carlo Maria Vigano. Almighty and Grant peace and prosperity to our nation. Illuminate those who bear us and aid me in committing myself to the common good in respect for your holy law. Protect those who, defending the inviolable principles of the natural law and your commandments, must face the repeated assaults of the enemy of the human race. Keep in the hearts of your children courage for the truth, love for virtue, and perseverance in the midst of trials. Make our families together with the Most Holy Mother and St. Joseph in the home of Mary. Give to our fathers and mothers the gift of strength to educate wisely the children with which you have blessed them. Give courage to those who, in spiritual combat, fight the good fight as soldiers of Christ against the furious forces of the children of darkness. Keep each one of us, O Lord, in your most sacred heart. And above all, he whom your providence has placed at the head of our nation. Bless the the world gives response to those who forsake him. He may be our help again. We contend with the enemy of God, a firm bulwark against the enemies, and a proud supporter of the children of light. Place the United States of America and the whole world under the mantle of the Queen of Victories, our unconquered leader in battle, the Immaculate Conception. It is thanks to her and to your mercy that the family stays on the land of the 
from the children whom you have redeemed in the most precious blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And now if anybody has any intentions that they would like to lift up at this moment, please feel free to unmute your microphone and do so now. Um, <clears throat> I would like to continue to lift up um, Marie as she's going through her battles. She seems to be doing a little bit better. Um, tomorrow she has her appointment to see what, what the biopsies were. Um, so I'm praying for a miraculous healing Lord on that. Uh, I pray for our marriage to deepen. And I also want to pray for um, my grandfather who passed away last week. Uh, that Lord, you just open your arms and open the gates for him that, um, that he may be able to enjoy paradise with you at this moment. Um, and then my, my uncle um, just help the doctors while they're performing the triple bypass surgery um, that, that nothing, everything goes well for the, all of that Lord. Um, and we do wanna lift up all souls in purgatory. I'd like to continue to lift up your siblings, uh, those who have fallen away from the faith and all those faith, all those that are faithful, the young adults, the young youth and adults alike. Um, a resurgence in the study of the catechism of the Catholic Church, as well as a continued um, devotion to the Gospels. Now I lift up Luisa Garcia is 40 day fast and just pray that he has a successful completion of, of his of his uh, fast period. I well, thank you for Lord for the great meeting today with Father Lustig and Art, all of us. Pray Lord that your hand would be upon Father Lustig and his desires to bring his at least younger men of his various missions, able to convince them that they need to come to this retreat, Lord, but uh, that's your calling. Lord, we just ask that you would work through Father to inspire these men to at least seek out in curiosity what it's all about and then be moved by you for their obedience to attend. Lord, we ask uh, blessings upon Art and his soon, soon, uh, to be ordination, help him get through the month of April for all the things he has to do to complete his final um, requirements of his diaconate program. And for all the men who are currently in this diocese in the diaconate training as they uh, become loaded down with assignments that um, tend to um, stress them out. Lord, just help them get through it, and inspire them, and give them courage to not give up uh, the program. Thank you, Lord, for the healing powers here. And, and, uh, and health improvements in my sister. Just ask that your continued uh, healing power would be upon her. And here's a way you could uh, remove her dementia altogether, Lord. We would pray against that and ask the demon of dementia be dissipated and totally sent to the pit of hell and that all of the manifestations would go with it and be burned there. That she could be free and be able to completely be cognitive of the surroundings of her environment. I ask your many blessings upon her. Bless us. Time of the three of us together, Lord, and all the sacred uh, implications that it um, 
that it holds. Thank you, Lord. And I would also just like to lift up uh, anything that if anybody had anything that they wanted us to pray for and we forgot to mention or or pray for that, that we just lift those up as well. All right, praying for the will of the Blessed Mother and service to the Blessed Mother for the glory of the King. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. O my Jesus, forgive us of our sins, and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, be our Lord, save the souls of thy unborn children, and all those in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all men. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Pray for us. The first sorrowful mystery is the agony in the garden. And before we pray the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Marys, join with us for meditative purposes in a prayer to Jesus in the agony of the garden. O oh, Jesus, who in the excess of your love and the love of God, you give abundant gifts to most human and good and most holy in God in Gethsemane. I pray you to lead my heart and soul to be often in the most bitter agony that you suffer in the garden, to pity you and to join with you and plead with you. O most holy Jesus, who bore during that night the weight of all our sins and paid for them, please grant me the great gift of contrition for my many sins which caused you to sweat blood. Most holy Jesus, by virtue of the terrible struggle you endured in Gethsemane, Give me the power of complete and final victory in the temptations that beset me, especially those to which I am most often subject. O oh my Jesus, by virtue of the anxieties, fears, and the unknown but intense pain which you suffered on the night in which you were betrayed, give me the light to follow uh, your holy will and to think upon and to understand the enormous effort and formidable struggle you endured victoriously in fulfilling not your will but the will of the father praise to you O jesus for the agony and the tears poured out during that holy night for the sweat of blood and the deadly distress you endured that solitude more frightful than man can imagine praise to you most sweet but vastly sorrowful jesus for the prayer at once human and divine uh, which poured forth from your agonized heart during that night of ingratitude and of treason. Be taught eternal comfort in our agony, all the more so since the greatest moment of the past and of the future, united with Jesus in the agony of, in the agony in the garden for all of us. Oh, most holy Trinity, cause the knowledge and love of the sacred passion of Gethsemane to be diffused into the world. And oh my Jesus, may those who love you and look upon the crucifix remember your incredible pain in the garden, and may they follow your example, learn to pray well, to fight and overcome, so they may eternally glorify you in heaven. Amen. The agony in the garden. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. 
truth of your foes who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us of our sins and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of men, their children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all men in heaven. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Second sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the pillar. And before we pray, our Father, followed by the decorative Hail Mary, join with us for medley and purposes and the recitation of the litany of trust. From the belief that I have to earn your love, deliver me from evil. From the fear that I am unlovable, deliver me from evil. From the false security that I have what it takes, deliver me from evil. From the fear that Trusting you will leave me more desolate. Deliver me, Jesus, from all suspicion of your words and plans. Deliver me, Jesus, from the rebellion against God and His Holy Word. Deliver me, Jesus, from refusals and reluctancies in accepting your will. Deliver me, Jesus, from anxiety about the future. Deliver me, Jesus. From resentment or excessive preoccupation with the past. Deliver me, Jesus. From restless self-seeking in the present moment. Deliver me, Jesus. From belief, disbelief in your love and presence. Deliver me, Jesus. From the fear of being asked to give more than I have. Deliver me, Jesus. From the belief that my life has no meaning or worth. Deliver me, Jesus. From the fear of what love demands. Deliver me, Jesus. From discouragement. Deliver me, Jesus. That you are continually holding me, sustaining me, guiding me. Jesus, I trust in you. That your love goes deeper than my sin. Jesus, I trust in you. That not knowing what tomorrow brings is an indication. Jesus, I trust in you, that you are with me in my suffering. Jesus, I trust in you. That my suffering, united to your own, will bear fruit in this life and the next. Jesus, I trust in you. That you will not leave me orphan, that you are present in your church. 
<laughs> that your plan is better than anything else. Jesus, I trust in you. That you will always know me and your goodness always respond. Jesus, I trust in you. That you give me the grace to accept forgiveness and keep it from others. Jesus, I trust in you. That you give me all the things I need for what I is asked. Jesus, I trust in you. That my life is a gift. Jesus, I trust in you. That you will teach me to trust you. Jesus, I trust in you. That you are my Lord and my God. Jesus, I trust in you. That I am your God. Jesus, I trust in you. The second sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. <clears throat> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from our sins, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Pray for us. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning of thorns. And before we pray, the Our Father. Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of the litany to the most precious blood of Jesus. Lord, have mercy. <clears throat> Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven. Have mercy. <clears throat> God, the Son, Redeemer of the world. Have mercy. God, the Holy Spirit. Have mercy. Holy Trinity, one God. <clears throat> Blood of Christ, holy to God. Save us. Blood of Christ, have mercy on the heart of God. Save us. Blood of Christ, our Lord, new and eternal. 
save us. Blood of Christ falling upon the earth in the agony. Save us. Blood of Christ shed profusely in the scourging. Save us. Blood of Christ flowing forth in the crowning with thorns. Save us. Blood of Christ. Save us. Blood of Christ, Christ of our salvation. Save us. Blood of Christ, without which there is no forgiveness. Save us. Blood of Christ, Eucharistic drink and refreshment of the souls. <clears throat> Blood of Christ, stream of mercy. Save us. Blood of Christ, a victor over demons. Save us. Blood of Christ, courage of mercy. Save us. Blood of Christ, strength of confessors. Save us. Blood of Christ, bringing forth virgins. Save us. Blood of Christ, help of those in peril. Save us. Blood of Christ, relief of the burdened. Save us. Blood of Christ, solace and sorrow. Save us. Blood of Christ, of the faith. Save us. Blood of Christ, consolation of the dying. Save us. Blood of Christ, peace and tenderness of heart. Save us. Blood of Christ, pledge of eternal life. Save us. Blood of Christ, freeing souls from purgatory. Save us. Blood of Christ, most worthy of all glory and honor. Save us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Thou hast redeemed us, O Lord, in thy blood. And made us. Let us pray. Almighty and eternal God, thou hast appointed thy only begotten Son the Redeemer of the world, and willed to be appeased by his blood. Grant we beg of thee that we may worthily adore this price of our salvation, and through its power be safeguarded from the evils of the present life, so that we may rejoice in its fruits forever in heaven. Through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our As we forgive those who trespass us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, God, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh my Jesus, forgive us of our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Jesus, we love you. Save the souls of our own children. Saint Pope John Paul II. The fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. And before we pray to our Father, followed by the decad of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes and the recitation of the litany of humility. O Jesus, meek and humble of heart, hear me from the desire of being esteemed. Deliver me, O Jesus, from the desire of being loved. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the desire of being extolled. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the desire of being honored. Deliver me. From the desire of being praised. Deliver me. From the desire of being preferred to others. Deliver me, Jesus. From the desire of being consulted. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the desire of being approved. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being humiliated. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being despised. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of suffering rebukes. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being calumniated. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being forgotten. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being ridiculed. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being wrong. Deliver me, O Jesus. From the fear of being suspected. Deliver me, O Jesus. That others may be loved more than I. Jesus, grant me the grace to be desired. That others may be esteemed more than I. Jesus, grant me the that in the opinion of the world, others may increase and I may decrease. Jesus, grant me the grace to be happy. That others may be chosen and set aside. Jesus, grant me the grace to desire it. That others may be saved and I save them. Jesus, grant me the grace to desire it. That others may be preferred to me. Jesus, grant me the grace to desire it, that others may become holier than I, provided that I may become as holy as I should. Jesus, grant me the grace to desire it. Charity is patient, is kind, charity does not end, is not pretentious, is not puffed up, is not ambitious, is not self seeking, is not provoked, thinks no evil, does not rejoice over wickedness but rejoices with the truth, bears with all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. To have charity is to love God above all things for himself and be ready to renounce all created things rather than offend him by serious sin. The fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our sins as we forgive those who've sinned against us. Do not bring us into the test, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Um, Saint Joseph. Pray for us. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion of our Lord Jesus. And before we pray, the Our Father, followed by the Decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of a prayer of St. Brigida of Sweden. O Jesus, true and fruitful life, remember the abundant of blood which thou didst so generously shed for thy sacred body, as juice from grapes and wine cups. From thy side, pierced with the lance by a soldier, blood and water issued forth until there was not left in thy body a single drop. And finally, like a bundle of myrrh lifted to the top of the cross, thy delicate flesh was destroyed. The very substance of thy body withered and the marrow of thy bones dried up. Through this bitter passion and through the outpouring of thy precious blood, I beg of thee, O sweet Jesus, to receive my soul when I am in my death agony. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion of our Lord. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day. We forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us of our sins and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. All you holy men and women, pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy. Hail, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, of the only begotten Son, and of thy Holy Spirit, resurrection, purchase for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee that by meditating upon these mysteries, of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. <clears throat> Remember, O Most Gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession was left unaided. Inspired with this confidence, I fly to thee, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, and before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. Praying for the intentions of the Pope, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Saint Michael, the arch archangel, defend us in battle. Be our defense again against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all of the evil spirits. To prowl about the world, world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Oh.